Hi humans! In this episode, our humans will be sharing what it costs to purchase and maintain a macaw. Or macaws, you can't forget me, Chester! I can never forget you, Aries. Let me try this again. In this episode, our humans will be sharing what it costs to purchase and maintain macaws! With that, and on a side note, there will be a full cost breakdown at the end of the video. So no need to take notes, humans. Sit back and relax as we explore our first topic. How much it costs to buy a macaw? Did you know buying a macaw is expensive? How expensive, Chester? Very. And this is true whether or not you adopt or go to a breeder. However, in this episode, we are going to just provide the cost from a breeder. Spoiler! Our humans are working on another episode to cover the cost if you were to adopt. Aries, you weren't supposed to tell them that yet. <laughs> we know you humans are quite busy doing human stuff, so I'll get right to the point. Mommy and Daddy Human paid $3,000 for me. With sales tax, that came to $3,210. For Aries, Mommy and Daddy Human paid $2,800. With sales tax, that came to $2,996. Hey, why did they cost less, Chester? Good question, Aries. Some types of macaws are harder to breed or have certain personality traits or characteristics that create a higher demand. Chester, were all of those real words? <laughs> yes, Aries, it gets quite complex. Did you know the most expensive macaw tends to be the Hyacinth macaw? They sell for as much as $20,000. Wow, that is a lot of money, Chester. They sure are pretty, though. They also have blue and gold just like me. Veterinary care is an important part of any animal's life. Our humans really love us and scheduled our first vet visit shortly after we were picked up. By the way, vet is short for veterinarian or animal doctor. The costs associated with vet visits can vary drastically. Here is what my first vet visit cost. Forgot me again, Chester. No, I didn't, Aries. What we'll do is we'll just take this number and multiply it by two. Mmm, mom to fly. Are those cookies? Aries. Chester, I love food. Can I do this one? Sure, Aries. Take it away. Okay, humans. We eat a lot of food. And our food needs to be nutritious and delicious so we can be healthy. Here's what our humans fed us this year. Again, humans, these costs will vary depending on the brand of food you select. Thank you, Chester! I almost forgot about that part! Chester, Chester, I want to do this one too! Go for it, Aries! We love toys! They are fun, look great, and taste great! Mmm! What Aries means is that macaws love toys they can destroy! We have super strong beaks and find chomping toys so much fun. That's right, Chester. So much fun. Woohoo! Here are the shots of the toys we were given this year. So many toys. Unfortunately, our humans didn't save all the receipts. Oh no, bad humans. Here are the cost breakdown for what our humans could find. Some of you may have seen the aviary build episode last year. The costs for that build are in that video, but we will include them here for reference. As you can see, macaws need lots of room, so please carefully consider this cost if you decide to add a feathered friend to your family. 
So here is the final cost breakdown. Phew! That was a lot of work, Chester. You're right, Aries. But think of all the nice humans we will be helping with this information. I love helping humans. They are so cute. Cute, 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 cute. We love you, humans. We hope you enjoyed this episode. As always, it really helps us out if you like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you. Have a good night, humans. Bye, humans. No, don't eat the...